How's it going, ladies and gentlemen? This is Beats Radio, and I am here with the one and only Darude. How's it going, buddy? Uh, going great. Uh, I'm back in Calgary, and uh, I'm excited. New place. Nice. Uh, before we get to the questions, I just, I just want to say happy beloved uh, birthday. Um, how did you celebrate it? How did I celebrate my birthday? I was, uh, I spent an amazing day with my son, my wife, and uh, two of our friend families at one of their uh, summer house in Finland. And um, went to sauna, uh, did some uh, paddle boarding, and uh, ate really well, too much. Nice, buddy, that's always, it's always good to get out. Um, I know you've been touring for a while now. And it's probably now getting to... Are you looking forward to sort of going back to the studio? Or are you going to take a hiatus after the tour's over? Uh, well, my, my tour, while it looks like it's one big tour, but I actually had a couple of weeks now that I didn't do that, that much. I did a couple of gigs in Finland. And um, uh, three weeks ago, I was in the States for a quick weekend. Uh, a couple of weeks before that I was in Ireland for one quick weekend but I've been coming and going uh, so I've been staying home here and there as well but uh, right now uh, it's just a mixture of uh, trying to uh, hang with the family as well actually the last couple of days I've been doing yard work uh, built a flower bed for my wife and and uh, pulled some weeds and stuff so that's a good change, but then at the same time, uh, in the evenings, uh, I've been in the studio and I, I was uh, remixing. I think I can't mention who I was remixing, but it was exciting because it's a guy who I looked up to before I started making music. In uh, 97, when one of his first big hits came out, I was just a clubber myself, or just had started making music, so it was cool to uh, get to do a remix. And it's done, and I'm actually going to play it tonight, but... I can't reveal yet who it is. No, that's fantastic. You probably just amped up uh, everybody that's going to watch this video because, well, they're probably going to watch it after, but still, awesome. That's good to hear. Um, you missed the Calgary Stampede. I don't, do you... Yeah. Did you know You know what the Calgary Stampede uh, is? Right? I, I know a little bit, yeah. And actually, uh, we just uh, we just had dinner with uh, a friend of ours from Whistler who's lived in uh, Winnipeg and, I, th I believe, Calgary as well. And... Uh, two of his friends who currently live here and they uh, said that it was awesome but they looked still a little worn out and they were like ushing and gushing about it so uh, in both good and a tired kind of way so I think uh, I dodged the bullet. Well I, I know I was going to bring you a little cowboy hat to wear it. <laughs> to I, we completely forgot it so for that maybe next time when you're here we'll, uh, we'll get you a cowboy hat, get you a picture because I think awesome. that's pretty much um, the what it entails to be yeah. from Calgary, yeah. Alberta, right? Yeah. But maybe I, next time. Next I, I heard the, the, the boys said that uh, it's it's great for R and R, but it's also uh, great for uh, business connections and uh, a, a lot of people who normally would be more formal, maybe suits and ties and stuff like that. But uh, they they let they let loose, and there's a lot of uh, starting from the morning breakfast. Uh, getting a little uh, drink on and whatnot. Uh, yeah. So it's, it sounds very cool. Nice. Um, is this the first time at the uh, Marquee? Uh, yes. Yes. I played in Calgary the first time in 2001, I think. Uh, possibly at a place called Palace, if I remember correctly. But, uh, but yeah, uh, so last time was in 2015 I played in Calgary. And uh, before that, there was a quite a long gap, maybe five years or something like that. You excited? Sorry? You excited? Oh, absolutely, yeah. Nice, nice. That's yeah. good to hear. Um, so, if you're going back to the studio, uh, well, when you do go back to the studio, is there an album in the works? Or? Uh, not an album per se, uh, but I'm actually very excited. Uh, was it August? 31st. 31st. Yeah. Okay, so yeah, uh, July 31st, there's a track called Singularity coming out with uh, Australian producer Zach Waters and it features vocals from Australian singer Enya Angel and uh, I'm working on another collab with another Australian guy called Uberjacked uh, at the moment and uh, that track doesn't have an official name yet and I don't have a release date for that but then I'm also working on a collab with uh, Ashley Walbridge and um, I'm probably gonna play uh, uh, the first draft of that tonight as well 
and so there's at least that I know right now two releases that are uh, coming out very soon and uh, I'm working on a couple of others as well so uh, this year there could be another one or two so three or four for this year still to come up, come out I'm quite excited about that uh, and um, it's just a not exactly an album, but I'm I'm, I'm trying to uh, maybe we'll we'll do so that once I get something like 10 to 12 tracks released, but they could be on separate labels or whatnot. But depending on contracts and whatever, I might just try and pull them together as you know That's to do right. a one one full album. Right. So awesome. Well, you guys heard it from the root. Lots of big things happening, so keep it tuned and also check out his website. You want to do a plugin? Sure. Well, Darude.com is my website, but uh, more so uh, slash Facebook slash Darude, uh, Twitter slash Darudeville, Darude Darude right, right. Uh, Instagram the same, and uh, I'm active on my social media myself, and so if you have a question for me, uh, if you are here tonight and you want to tell me I sucked or rocked, come at me, brah. Always a comic book guy. Thank you so much for listening. You can catch this interview at www.beatsradio.ca. Have a good one, guys.